Hello, citizens of an imagination of Provence. Welcome to the Frontiers. So We're playing you for Iron Man. Clearly the best of modes. Um, got one of our leaders. I kind of have a feeling that Austria, if they would just combine all of that shit, would easily just... Although these are mountains, so they would probably have a best chance attacking this Armata di Roma. And uh, this army is just standing still. Yeah, I think they're securing sieges or something like that. So I do hope that they do actually unsiege those stupid rebel provinces. I mean, those are just peasants. You might as well just not siege them, please. It's kind of stupid. It's kind of stupid how they work like that, but... Uh... I guess you cannot have perfect vassals, you cannot have perfect allies, you cannot have perfect anybody. If you want to do something good, do it yourself. I imagine Castile doesn't really want anything from this war. Um, oh yeah, and we're still receiving subsidies from them, which is real nice. There goes the one siege of one province. Yay! Did you transfer? No, it's occupied by both. Oh, finally, you're done with your siege. Maybe you should actually, like, consolidate your armies and kick this shit in. No? No, doesn't sound good? Come on, dude. You got 10,000 men chilling in freaking Unhold. <clears throat> Why do you have 10,000 men chilling and doing nothing in Unhold? At least Brandenburg is coming down here. I mean, he's being useful. La, 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 la. And at, I mean, at least the sieges are going, so that's good. And uh, somehow, Naples managed to get an offensive battle in Tyrol against Austrians. This is just plain magic right here. <laughs> I do like this magic, though. This magic is... I approve of this magic. It's a pretty nice magic here. Alright, here's Castilian sieges. They're not going to transfer the sieges until I siege something adjacent to it. <coughs> if you're wondering. In this war, who's helping us? Austria, Brittany, Lorraine, Platinate. Yeah. Same. All the same people. Our diplomats are lazy. What can we do with our diplomats? What can we do? Don't know what to do with the big foot, but... Oh, you will now accept a cold arms. Yeah, that's great. So now you're also in this war. And uh, I'm not sure if you were in this war before, but I think you were. Now, Mr. Poland. Provence is at war. Mr. Denmark. Provence is at war. Danish opinion about us. Alright, so send the diplomats to Denmark. Maybe we'll manage to get something out of it. Out of that. Oh, here we go. Finally, those 10,000 men actually do stuff. Alright, well, we do still have numbers advantage, it would seem. Maybe not? Okay. Could still declare that statute in restraint of appeals. It's not like we're pissing out anyone important, is it? Lorraine, Burgundy, Savoy, France, Papal State. So we're already piss pissing off the people that we're already pissed off, so... Yeah, that's worth it. Let's do that. Siege mm -hmm. Avignon. Yeah, that will be done. That will be done, my friend. <coughs> I think I feel... I feel uh, confident in attacking this. Maybe I shouldn't have felt confident about attacking this, but here I am, attacking this. And failing miserably, because, uh, I'm rolling terribly. That is for sure, but Austria is on the way, so yeah, yay for Austria. More meat for the meat slaughter, meat grinder, whatever. Yeah, we are beating up France. France was stupid. France was so, so stupid. 
Right, I think we need to work in Switzerland. Switzerland might be a good ally. Hey, there's a mission to prove prestige. Take Avignon from our rival papal state. I think this might be a good one, so let's go siege that. So we're gonna get all, try to get all of our cores. That would be a priority one, I'd say. Austria managed to recover. Good for you, Austria. Very nice. Nicely done. Not sure if actually can they, they can get everything towards us, or it's just like, I don't know, something. I don't even know what I'm talking about, because, yeah, apparently I've lost the ability to speak. We don't have many men. We don't have many men, but we do have Brittany. I think we should consolidate. Yeah, we, we have in total three regiments of our own. So if Brittany ever decides to unattach, we're screwed. Holy shit, our war exhaustion is high. How high is it? It's 10. Yeah, let's reduce that shit. I don't like it. When it's 10, I don't like it. France pieced out Austria with a white piece. That's not great, but uh, that's just Austria. We already also have Castile here. We also have uh, our other people, Augsburg, Trier, Brandenburg, everybody else. You know, we could still win this. And I guess then Austria can focus on uh, beating up our coalition for us, so that's great. I might, no, I could get a white piece out of punitive war, but uh, I don't think I want a white piece out of punitive war. I want more. More territory! More land! More everything! <laughs> yeah, bitches be crazy. Okay. More sieges for Castilians, that's good. I do hope that that works as it does, as it usually does, and as soon as Rojou falls, then he is going to transfer us all these occupations. Hey, Fakir! Oh, poor Austria. So disparate! How are you so disparate with your troops? Come on, get them all over here and kick the pape, kick the pope in the face, kick him in the nuts. Get coalition, get attacked by coalition, take more land. I know, right? Although maybe we could just... Uh... What I mean by taking more land is probably releasing people. What is this mayonnaise sorcery? Mayonnaise too strong. Mayonnaise stronger than baguette. And especially baguette with mayonnaise. <laughs> hey, Naples decided to siege Brandenburg. Out of all the people, you're like, yeah, I'm gonna fucking siege Brandenburg. Not the smartest idea of them all. Not the smartest idea of them all. Of course they shall have our support. <clears throat> Why wouldn't they get our support? <clears throat> Sorry. And we can be rich, because we're not paying for our army. Our vassal is paying for his army. <laughs> hey, hey! I'm a dirty bastard. <laughs> Just add bacon and everything will be fine. Well, maybe I should white piece my coalition. Probably not uh, enough time has passed yet. No, I don't think so. I don't think enough, enough time passed yet. Hello, people state. Goodbye, people state. Papa. The Papa see. Oh no! Castile, be, be careful. Please, be careful, Castile. You might still lose. Yeah, but well, there is a, there is a pretty good strategy that you could follow. That I followed, and it's, as you can see, we're kicking, kicking French ass right now. Of course, kicking French ass would probably be impossible without Castile and uh, Austria both, but uh, it's still still a strategy that works pretty well, I'd say. Alright, our vassal is getting sieged. I, I cannot watch this. 
think we'll have to peace out. Uh, what's this? This is improving relations with people. Right. I don't need with Brandenburg anymore, thank you. At this rate, of Brandenburg might actually vote for us <laughs> soon. Alright, let's get religious power. France's weakest nation in the EO4. I agree. France needs buffs. France needs some strong buffs. Honestly, like Ulm. Ulm is just wrecking face. I think Ulm needs nerfs. Look at those national German ideas. Those are too good. <laughs> la la la. Yeah, that that's a, that was a song. That was a song. I know that song. It sing. It, you did sing it a little bit wrong, but it's a good one nonetheless. So France wants peace now. No, thank you. We're gonna fight to the last, to the last breath. <laughs> oh my god. To the last breath. We shall fight. <laughs> Needs 180% discipline and morale is first national idea. I know, you know what? This might still not be enough. All things considered, this might still not be enough. Like, I'm actually worried that this might not be enough. Like, it's just too strong. You cannot, you cannot fight that. You cannot possibly fight it. You cannot possibly fight with France. It's like, it's impossible. You cannot win. Can I just get humiliated, please? No? What do you even want? Get lost. Get lost! Well, there it goes. Burgundy declared war on Liege. Not on France. And the uh, Emperor decided to decline the call, I assume. A wise decision, Mr. Emperor. Now, I do hope that he transfers the occupations. Come on, dude. Get a Merc army. I don't really need a Merc army, considering I have Brittany. Oh, hello there, Aragon. What? Why do you have so many... What do, how does Aragon have so many darn troops? Freaking thousands. Oh, there he goes. He transferred the occupations. Good for you. <coughs> oh, they are. Bye-bye, Leash. Yeah. Bye-bye, Leash. Bye-bye, Leash. Alas, you were not meant to be a liege of mine, uh, question mark, something, funny comments, sort of. Oh, come on, this is just not fair. You're just sitting here waiting for the battle to end, you stupid, you sneaky, sneaky Aragon. Can I get some help here, Platinate? No? Well, fuck you too, then, Palatinate. God damn it. He was walking in there, and then he stopped. And now we lost all of our troops. And I think Brittany lost all of their troops, too. So bullshit. Bullshit. Well, at least, you know, on the bright side, we don't have to pay for our army. So we don't have one, we don't have to pay for it. So that's great. Mm hmm mm hmm So I always I as I always said, if you don't have an army you don't have to pay for it, eh? Aragon worst enemy. Aragon fucking sucks. He's got so many stacks. Look at that. What is bullshit? He's got three thirty thousand. It's like comparable to France and Burgundy and shit. So stupid. How does that even possible? All right, you know what, France? I think maybe your time has come. Time has come for you to peace out. So we want Dauphine. That's our core. No. Wait, what? Why does it cost us so much to things to do things to you? Oh well. So it costs us quite a bit to do things to you. We have a legitimate core on you. 
We have legitimate claims on you. It's going to cost us a lot. Cancel vassals, yes. You will do it. Release. The fiend. No. It's not going to do it. Can I take another province? No. Can I take war reparations? I probably can, and I shall. So that's going to be war reparations. We'll have need. We'll, we'll need more. We need more points about that anyway. We want. We need more diplomatic points to do any kind of peace. We, at all. It's stupid. Stupid mechanics. You have to actually do things. You actually have to pay things for things, and uh, yeah, it's quite expensive to do things. So poor Brandenburg is getting occupied. That's not good. By Naples. Oh, and yes, Aragon also has Naples as their bitch, so that's great. <laughs> oh. Hilarious, isn't it? Just remarkably hilarious. Remarkably hilarious. Remarkably. I got a minus, f minus seven war score now because we lost a bunch of battles. God damn it. Come on, Austria. Look alive. Do things. Why are you so... <laughs> what is this 1,000 regiment doing here? I don't know. Wait. Did he actually... No, he didn't. Austria is still not in the Liegean War. Then what the fuck is he doing down there? Eh? Should improve relations with England to get them out of coalition. That's a good call. Let's get them out of coalition. I don't like. St huge coalitions are bad for business. They're bad for business. Austria's not in this French war. Oh, he's going down there. I see. But what is he going to achieve? Probably nothing. Probably nothing as, I, as far as I can tell. Probably nothing. Oh, he's attacking this. He's actually winning. Wow. Yeah. Aragon has tech level 3, it seems, still. And Brandenburg's on the way. So that's good. That's going to be a good battle for the war score with this coalition thing. That's great. That is genuinely great. Great. You are great. Is this Denmark? It's Denmark. Can go home now. Da, 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 da. Good release of vassal. How many cores does Toulouse have? Toulouse has one, two, three, probably four. Four cores. Toulouse has four cores. Maybe you should take Languedoc and release and re release Toulouse from it and feed Toulouse. Yeah, that would be a nice idea. Some allies at a coalition war? No, it doesn't seem to be the case. <coughs> He's keen on sieging capital. He just, he just wants it. He just wants to siege the capital, nothing else. At least I appreciate the effort there, Austrian. That's pretty good. I appreciate the effort, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> so far, a very, a very violent, volatile start. I do kind of sort of expect Burgundy to go to war with, with France, but I guess not. <laughs> yeah, if I get that Pope province, then people cannot, won't be able to take my capital in the war anymore. But uh, do I really need to? Do I need? To make sure that people cannot take my capital in the war. Hello, Sir Jim, Jimo, Jimo, and Denticon. Jimo, Jimo, Jimo. Subway, could you? Oh, 
I could just surrender. Yeah! Fuck you, Savoy. Get the fuck out of here. There we go. Let's focus on the war with France. You're not, you're not welcome here, Savoy. You're not welcome here. Bring is no longer a valid, valid rival for us. I wonder why. <laughs> Probably because we, I don't know, have no army? <laughs> no, of course, certainly not. Why would that be even the case? Sir Jibu. Jibu or Leo. Subsidies will be immediately cancelled. Immediately cancelled? Wait, what's this? She's Tlemcen and Morocco. Really? I wish I could see, like, what was the war. Check for Poland Ally. No, it's, it's Mazovia. I still think that we are at war. It's uh, They think it's still pretty... A pretty long and outrageous war, but uh, you can show them that it's not true, of course. We're winning it. We do have enough points to peace out, probably, with everything we wanted. So we're going to take Languedoc and Narbonne. Oh, they'll actually accept a 99. Holy shit, I need 330 diplomatic power for all this nonsense. This is so, so bullshit. <laughs> God damn it, defenders shouldn't be able to, shouldn't be charged so much. God damn it. I like a steel. They will not take an alliance. Oh they will actually, alright. So I like a steel. Hey Castile, my buddy friend. Let's uh you will offer an alliance or I shall. <laughs> there we go, those occupations kinda of domino effect. Castile White Beast. Castile fucking white beast. Alright, whatever. They transferred occupations anyway, so... <coughs> it's all... <coughs> Sorry. It's all fair. It's all fair, France. Oh, uh, Castile. I st still love you. Still love you. Still love you. Let's start to focus on Diplo. Hmm. <laughs> it's okay. We we they they helped us enough. So I consider, like the, they they peace they gave us the occupation of Berry and peaced out. I consider that to be a nice thing. Like you did a good job, Castile. You did good. <coughs> anyway, guys, I think it's time to put a cut in between YouTube episodes. So if you're watching this on YouTube, thank you guys for watching this on YouTube. Don't forget to comment. Rate and possibly subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. I will see you again next time. As always, of course, have a good day.